Chapter 21 Chaos in Grimoire Okay, so where are we supposed to start? Well, if we can track down Cloud, Squall, and Lightning, they could probably use a little help with the Cockna. Right, but where are they? Oh, we need more intel! Oh, for that the kind of stuff, you should definitely consult with Seraphie. Hang on while I go in to get her! Yeah, hi. So I suppose you're gonna make me break out the old rumor radar for you. Rumor radar? Oh, that's my secret power, hun. It lets me instantly snap up every bit of gossip within my threshold. In a teensy world like this, that basically only amounts to everything. Whoa, now that's cool! Huh? Is it cool? Well, I'm no expert, but I'd say it is. Woohoo! I thought I'd never be one of those cool pixies. Well, you'd be the cooler if you picked up facts instead of rumors. Thanks for that reminder. Uh, well, so do you mind trying it? Yeah, sure. I guess I'll start us out by narrowing down the search to those Cogna we're after. Sound good? Here's the latest. There you have it. 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 Here's the latest. So, like, things are basically terrible everywhere? That's a problem. We can't be in all of those places at once. Time! I COMMAND YOU TO STOP! Okay, can we just build a time machine or something? Inside Ninewood Hills, you do realize that time is essentially stopped? Oh, wait! That girl behind the door in Ninewood Hills! Couldn't she help us reach everyone? Huh? You're right! Inside her room, we can skip around to any point in time that we want! shown on the world map. Do you mind if I take a little nap? What now? Who 
Whose soul will you touch? Another wave. Magna rotors, six o'clock. Approaching at speed. Distance, 0.8 clicks. Phoebe, directly behind you. 800 out. <sighs> I'm on it! All targets down. Not a direct hit this time, but the blast was enough. We can't keep doing this forever. If I may, sir. There must be a mobile command center. A cogna that tells the others what to do. If we can locate that and destroy it... Command center? There is that cogna we've been trying to pin down. But... You've heard the same reports as I have. Not even the Black Mage's magic was able to put a dent in it. Even if we found it, how are we supposed to stop it? If only we could use machines. Fight fire with fire like Rain and Lawn did. Fight fire with fire. I think I know someone who can help. What is it? I heard that you wished to speak to me? Allow me to get directly to the point. That Magitek armor of yours, can it damage the Cogna's mobile command center? The one in the desert? I suppose it might be possible. Edgar, you're staring. Oh, my apologies. I couldn't help but be captivated by your beauty. Tell me, did it hurt when you fell from heaven? Again? Really? Hmm? <laughs> oh, you're playing hard to get, I see. <sighs> so back to the subject at hand. Is it possible? Or no? My Magitek armor. I summoned it just like a mirage. So I imagine it must be similar to the Cogna. If so... Logically speaking, it should be able to hold its own against them. But... I wasn't myself when I used it. Seguaritus was controlling me. Say no more, I understand. Forgive me for opening up old wounds like that. Shame on me. But then, of course, my lady is free to inflict a few wounds of her own, now that she has laid my heart bare. Okay, so what do we do about the Cogna? Should we get Rain and Lawn after all? <sighs> Good question. Rain. Lawn. Right. I never did get a chance to repay them. But I can help them now. All right. I'll do it. It's time. Repositioning. I must withdraw. It's time. I'm on the move. On the move. It's time. I'm on the move. Ah! It's time. I'm on the move. Here goes nothing. It's time. 
I'm on the move. Here goes nothing. There! Got it! I'm so sorry. Here goes nothing. Thunder! Here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. Yeah. Ah! That's the end of that. Well, I hope I'm at least saving them a little trouble. Do you mind if I take a little nap? What now? Whose soul will you touch? If that hits us head on... I'll just have to hold them off here. Good luck. Lightning, Aiko, and my Princess Sarah. Well, that was cutting it close. Lucky for us, it isn't the sharpest tool in the shed, huh? Thank you for coming, Aiko. Your journey here must have been long and risky. Huh? Aww. It really wasn't that big of a deal. I'm just happy I could be of service. And besides, the only job I have is to flip the switch, so to speak. It's called the Loot of Ragnarok, isn't it? Lightning's assessment was spot on. The Loot is like Big Bridge. It's an Eidolon that's entered into a deep sleep. I'm amazed you never realized what you had. But... If I didn't know about it, how could you? Cornelia's history goes back a long way. From what I understand, our first king was a summoner. I think it's safe to say there's no doubt about it now. Well, whatever the case, our new friend will need lots of magic to bust through that Cogna's armored shell. Yes, but lightning will come through for us. Gotta hurry before that thing gets off another shot. Every second counts. Gotta hurry before that thing gets off another Oi. shot. <gasps> Every second counts. <gasps> Hit! <laughs> 
yourself hesitate. Oh, I thought for certain the youngsters had returned. Now who might you be? Most people call me Lightning, and that's just what I have to be right now. Sorry, but I need to do this fast. Hey, guess who's back? Listen, we were kind of hoping you might lend us that judgment staff of yours. <laughs> I knew it. You two were here after all. Well, technically, it's just lightning. Alas, though. If you are here for the staff, you are just a tad too late. You see, I have already passed it on to my scion. Sighing? About what? It's scion. Should I pull out a dictionary, or are you in a hurry? Just do what I always do and pretend that he's not even talking. So, who has the staff now? My granddaughter. Your what? It's true. Oi! Sweetheart! Come say hello to our guests! Hey! Ralph Mew! Oh, come on! Listen now, Grandpa. I'm sure she's a real sweetheart, but shouldn't she be out of diapers Loser. before you- Sure you don't need a diaper? Let me assure you, my granddaughter is more than capable of wielding the staff. If you want it for yourselves, you will just have to win it from her in combat. What? Go get her, sis! Just me? Where do you think you're going? Well, you know that what they say, once sapped, twice the shy, or, um, something like that. see that the pair of you have regained much of your former power. You got that right. We've been through way more mayhem than you give us credit for, and not the fun kind. Oh, right. Well, I did promise. You can have the staff. I know what you've come for. Is this it? Yeah. Thanks for not making this hard. When you're done with it, do return it. You say the staff belongs to my granddaughter now. 
I promise. Do you mind if I take a little nap? What now? Who's so... That's what I've been waiting for. It's over, Cogna! Wow! I wish I had a super beam like that. What would you even do with it if you had one? Now, come on. We have to stop this thing before it goes any further. Got it. Did it? Really? Maybe you did. Or maybe some nosy friends of ours decided we needed their help. Is that so? So they saved me once again. Lon. Rain.
What are we up against? I don't know, but everything from its HP to its um everything is the right on the scale. Have we even got a shot at this thing? Fortunately, it seems like its yeah, healing yeah, abilities are the limited. So then, we shouldn't expect to take it down in one shot. Huh? Wait, what do you mean? I mean, we fight it as many times as it takes. Dude, that means we have to live through the first time. Now, whose soul will you? <sighs> That's how many? <sighs> Don't know.
What now? Who saw? So
it. Oh, that's enough fighting for an entire lifetime. <sighs> Glad you stuck with us. Rain. Lawn. Need something? What now? Whose soul will you touch? Sid, have you found a pattern yet? Where's the phantom train? Hmm, still no luck, I fear. It gives new meaning to random, I can tell you that much. <sighs> well, if you can't track it, we'll have to give up for now. A train that traverses the real and unreal, just our luck. And it only shows itself when it's ready to attack. Not an honorable mirage, is it? If only we had documentation of how these Mirage trains work, even just some blueprints would do. That's it! That's what, Rain? We already know someone who runs a Mirage train! Um... Oh! Cactus Guy! That's right! The time to exact my revenge has finally arrived! Your sass is grass! <laughs> you certainly are fired up today now, aren't you, my little giant girl? Um, Rain, I know you're excited about this, but can I cut in? Sure, be my guest. Conductor, if my sister beats you, how about you promise to give us the blueprints to your train? Deal? Oh, we're on! But that's a big if you're talking about! Here I come! Ah, bring it! Come on, come on, come on! Want some tea? What now? Whose soul will you... This is the place Lon and Rain told us about. Yes, we should be right on time. But I don't get it. How did they figure out where the Phantom Train will appear? Beats me. They work in strange ways. <laughs> Bingo. Right on schedule. Wasn't that a... you know... Oh yeah, another ghost... <laughs> You could have just covered your ears. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's that this. weird machinery coming out of it? That train must be related to the Cogna somehow. It's just a Cogna? Oh, that's no big deal. What are you talking about? Yeah, it's a huge the deal. Hey, stop picking on me. Where's my agent? I'm leaving. What the, sis? Where are you going? Come back. Hello? Please? Gotcha! <sighs> Whoa. For a second there, I thought you were really big. She was the considering it.
Celeste, wasn't that your name? Yes, that's right. Celeste, you've got skill. Why don't you join Seed? Sorry. I've no intention of joining a group like that again. It doesn't have to be a permanent arrangement. Think it over. We could use someone as tough as you. I'll give it some thought. Anyway, did you notice? We weren't the only forces at play during that battle. Hmm? You're right. I thought it went down more easily than expected. <laughs> when I see those two, I guess I'll have something else to thank them for. As will I. I agree that that thing's buzz is super annoying, but it's also really dangerous. Right. We've been lucky, but some towns have suffered great damage thanks to the explosives that Cogna drops from the air. Explosives, you say? And how are they made? Well, they don't seem to be the same as real bombs. I've heard they're more like some sort of magical charge. A new kind of magic, eh? You don't say. You there. The jock with the guilds of a flounder. Huh? What? You mean me? See another jock here? Oh, come on, Doc. You could Think call I me by my... Think I care about your name? Surely you jest. Now get out there and capture that annoying pest. Huh? Oh, use that thing from the game you play. The silly water ballet. You mean Blitzball? Yes, that. Knock it out of the sky, then bring it back here. I'll be waiting over in my laboratory. Chop chop, my dear. Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, listen. Is there anything I can do to help? That'd be awesome. Thank you. to me. Thing a mosquito? I'll go look for a giant bottle of bug spray! Somehow, I don't think bug spray is gonna be much help this time. Okay!
It didn't seem any worse for the fall, did it? That might have got nasty on my own. I owe ya, Valifor. Oh, uh, you too, Lawn and Rain. Huh? Wait, why did I thank two people who aren't even here? I'm weird. With my knowledge and skill, I can make better use of this new magic than those silly Cogna creatures ever will. There you are. Just so you know, a message is waiting for you at the airship. Do you have a moment? Sure. What's up? We've located the King of Bahamut and his lieutenants. Dude, really? Really, dude. Where are they? The end of the chains. Uh, what now? You already know the town's under Federation control are anchored to chains that extend into the sky. Uh, don't tell me. Oh, I'm telling you. We know now that all of those anchors were fired from the same exact location. And that spot must be Bahamut's seat of power. So you're saying their castle, it just floats there? Apparently. If Balam Garden can do it, then why not the Federation? Great! Then we can just sail the up there in our airship! Not quite. Here's the problem. Their castle sits at a much higher altitude. The airship simply isn't built to travel that high. Oh, come on. Then what do we do? First, you should visit a cathedral. A cathedral? Yes. At the heart of every town that's a part of the Federation. You're certain to find one. They're sanctuaries that only admit people chosen as architects. And they're much more than that. You need to see it. Once you have, then I'll explain how to get to the castle. A cathedral, huh? Where are we supposed to find that? Remember that strange town we visited? The one where you said something felt kind of off? Yeah, the one where you told me we should keep a low profile, right? I bet that was a cathedral in the middle of town. We've seen lots of towns like that the since. We shouldn't have to go that far to find one. What happened here? Once the Cogna invade a town and take the control, it looks like the town becomes the corrupted. There's mirages here. Be careful. So the building in the center of town is the cathe, the cathe, cathedralism? Huh? Did you want to then listen to some music or something? It's cathedral. Just keep an eye out for mirages, okay? Why? Why aren't the heralds helping us? and prophecy didn't say anything about this.
What, what is all this stuff? Tell me, what of the soul crystal? How much of the populace have we harvested? If I had to offer up a guess, then just about four souls in every ten. No way. The architects... were they...? All this is the true face of the Federation. I already knew that I didn't like them, but this just turns my stomach. The architects are making the world better. It's true, if you're the Federation. That's exactly what they do. The Architects can live the remainder of their lives in peace, and never want for food. Yes, the moment their souls turn to crystal, and ascend to Bahamut's castle, their wish becomes reality, since crystals don't fight or eat. As for work, all they are required to do is become energy, and so they get their life of leisure as well. So what, everyone should be happy? Ugh, give me a break! Ron is the right! This is... this is completely the messed up! Shulk, did you know about it? I did. In fact, I was put in a cathedral. Dude, what? At first, I believed what they said and became an architect. I was admitted to a cathedral and I nearly had my soul crystallized. But by sheer coincidence, an accident halted the system, and I managed to escape. Later, Shinra took me in, battered, broken soul and all. They helped me. When we learned the truth, we knew we had to act, and that's how the Anti-Federation Resistance got started. Still, until the world fell into chaos, this Breaking into a cathedral was out of the question. But now we know. These are the entrances to our enemy's castle. Really? You mean... the chains? They're the way. They deliver all of the crystal. Correct. Once the architect's souls have been crystallized, the chains conduct them all the way up to the castle. But how are we the supposed to take the chain all the way to the top? Well, if you're human... It sounds like you have to be a giant to use the chain. Huh? Awen explained how it works. You see, she took the chain road when she went to the castle. She's up there? She said the road was designed for the Bahamushan army. You need to be both a giant and a mirage user in order to traverse it. So... Right. It's gotta be us. What? Rain, come on. If we're the only ones who can go, then there's no room for debate here. Yeah, I know. All right! Let's kick some Baja butt and give this world a saving it won't forget. After all, if we really did cause all of this mess, it's about time that we settled up. If you're not this sure you're strong enough yet, I think you should get out there and round up some more mirages. Yes. And the world continues to struggle. Don't forget about all the people down here. They need your help. Don't you think? Remember, that castle is Bahamut's stronghold. When you do go, make sure you go prepared.
<sighs> I'm starting to get chain sick. Careful! The mirages here mean the business! Good! Because the stronger they are, the stronger they can make us! Right, Lon? Right! Bring I hope we catch up to win in time. Another sister. I guess we're doing this. Come on! What's this? Wait, Lon! What do you think you're- Stop! Huh? Rain? She vanished. Oh, then no! What are we going to do? Uh, I don't know! Don't look at me! Huh? I think she's calling me! Huh? No, Tama, not you, the two! <sighs> okay, what now? What do I do? I've lost them both! Why, 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 why did they disappear? If you won't. Where do they go? Hey, Seriously, no come back! Oh, why did they not leave me? <laughs> oh, you guys. I knew you were okay. I mean, we've seen plenty of contraptions like this. Uh-huh. Don't pretend like you weren't freaked out. 
With these devices, it shouldn't take us anywhere near as long to make it to the top. But from now on, don't touch anything without checking with me first. You got that? Yep, got it. What did I just say? <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'll be good. Yeah, we got this. I guess we're doing this. to do it. Oh. I won't hold back.
Rain, I'm sorry. Uh, for what? I give up. I don't want to climb this thing anymore. Hey, it's too early to give the up! <sighs> if Wynn can make the climb, then we can make it too. At least I hope so. Tell us more about the X9 Knights. They're no good nefarious the Mimis who want to fill in a crow's worlds with hatred. N nefair. So what you're saying is that they don't play fair. Well, that much goes without saying. I guess we're doing this. Good
Let's make... We beat him once, we can beat him again. I don't think that Brandalus guy was even trying before. Well, so what? I wasn't trying either. Thanks, Lon. That's the good to know. Yeah, very encouraging. Hey, uh, what can I say? Anything else about those three heralds? Nothing the first hand. The X9 Knights are the like an army. They have the lots of members, so it's no the wonder I haven't met the three here in Grimoire. There's that many of them? Dude! Not only that, the ones with names and the numbers are the cruelest and most dangerous of all. Each is responsible for the destroying many of Inacro's the worlds. Didn't the champions rise up to stop them? Of course they the tried. Without the champions, the whole Googleplex of worlds would have the fallen. But wait, don't all three of the heralds have names? They sure the do. We've the heard them call each other by those names. I've never the seen three of them in one place before. Well, don't worry. We have the champions and a whole host of mirages to help us protect Grimoire. Right. So come on. Let's get this done! Thank you. 
trouble at all. Oh, yeah! I guess we're doing this. Come on, bring it. Good fight. Oh, yeah. This is it. The final stronghold. Castle X9. The silence is giving me the heebie-jeebies. All the same, we the too creepy.
Look at this. It's just... Beyond description. It's too strange to belong in this world. Sometimes I think you are too. But, yeah. Right. Predictable. Remember, we're probably inside the one of the Herald's thresholds, if not all three. Fresh what? Don't even pretend you forgot what that is. So, we're already inside the danger zone? I think the soul. They're powerful enough to recreate bits and the pieces of their own worlds inside the threshold. Just the like this. Wait, but that means if we go kaput... I might not be the able to rewind you to safety. You have to be very the careful. Dude. Yeah. That was a good fight. Good job. Thresholds are more than just barriers, aren't they? 
technically, they're more like a powerful force field, inside of which the world's rules can be the bent and great feats performed. So, whenever we step through a threshold, we're stepping inside someone else's private world? That's the right! I knew it wouldn't take the long for you to understand. But for someone to the create a world this physical, this real inside their threshold, they would have to expend a tremendous the amount of energy. Not just anyone can do it. All that soul crystal being sent here. Right. It's, uh, probably doing the, um... It's okay, Lon. You don't have to contribute. Well, whatever form a threshold takes, we know how they work in general, so at least we'll be ready. That's the right. And you may not have the noticed, but both of you have thresholds too. Whoa, really? Huh? I think Lon's head is the starting to smoke. All this info must have finally blown his mind. To do it. Victory! Got the advantage. So many mirages here. Doesn't the Federation worry about sharing a castle with them? Somehow I doubt it. After all, a wolf knows better than to bear his fangs at a behemoth. They don't stand a chance against the King of Bahamut. There's just this something about him that feels fundamentally the different than the other two heralds. Trouble at all. Good job.
Right, let- Good fight. Good job. to the entrance isn't that the carbuncle that was with Alwyn I mean the woman in the mask I guess we're doing this come on bring it Did we beat him? I don't feel his presence. Hopefully that means he's gone from the castle, if nothing else. Right. Oh. 
Okay, here... How far does this go, anyway? Hon, just keep it cool. Uh, sorry, I'm just so excited we're finally gonna beat those guys that I'm getting impatient. <laughs> Predictable.
Yeah, we got this. I guess we're doing this. Well, that ought to do that it. That wasn't so bad. Great how there's so many mirages to find here. Oh, yeah, this place is the best. Trouble at all. Oh, yeah.
dude, it's... Ready. Wasn't so bad. Come on, hang in there, you the two. We're getting a little the bit closer to them every step that we. Ah! Huh? What's the matter, Tama? N nothing. Something just that gave me a start. That's all that it was. You'll be here in spirit, and that's what counts. We'll call you if we get into trouble. Please? For us, okay? Oh, all the right. But stay on the guard. You still have no idea who you're the dealing with. Hey, we can handle them. I mean, come on. We've held our own against almost everything we faced. Hmm. Right. And don't forget, he's got me. We'll be fine. <sighs> All right, if you're the with him. What? I'm no good on my own? That goes without the saying. Dude, ouch! Okay. Well, if you're sure, I guess I'll head the back. See you soon! All the right? Yep. You know it. Bye. So, the final leg. Lon, you ready? Yeah. Let's thrash those heralds. 
so we can finally go home. Right.
lady loose! How long must this continue, Pelinor? A hundred years and counting now, and yet commanding just one body proves a chore. How lowly and pathetic can you get? My body gives me more trouble than yours does. Oh, but I do wonder about that. Hey, scumbag! We've been looking for you! If you think you can just wreck the world and get away with it, then you have got another thing coming! When are you... Uh, Alwyn, you okay? So you've made it this far. But no more. You have to stop. You mustn't fight. I know you want to. But you simply can't. What drivel! What tripe! A farce beyond compare! Are you quite certain of that? What if they are the world's true champions awakened at last? Should we not deal with them now? And now it's you who's causing me to grin. The Crimson Prophecy's a done affair. The story needs no postscript, no twist and no spin. Exeunt. Begone, you whelps! Do this one! That's right! It's on! all the unready.
So bad. smile. You should turn those corners up, or your happiness will spill right out. You don't want that to happen. But everybody makes fun of me because they say my arm is creepy. But look, mommies are the same. See? And there's more. Did you know 
that these arms are very special? They're proof of the joy you'll bring the world. But only one of my hands looks like yours. You have one, Lan has the other. So as long as you both work together, there's no happiness you can't attain. Please, you have to stop gathering so many mirages. Why's that? We're really good at it. You of all people should be proud. Yeah, it's a good thing. You don't have a proper handle on any of them. Think of the trouble you're making for those around you. Well, what do I care? It's not any trouble for us. Fine, then don't you care about your mother? The more you... the more mirages that you take away from oh, her... Oh, please. Mom loves seeing us excel. Don't even pretend it doesn't make her happy. Dad, I just think you're jealous because you don't know how to do it. Busted. You're the one who said that everyone's lives would be easier if we summoned those gods or whatever. Don't chicken out now, Win. Yeah, remember? Why else would we even be up here? You're wrong! A path to another world will- Just shut the honk up. Oh, I know what to do with you. What? Are you the one who summoned me? <laughs> what is going on? <gasps> hey, who are you? Children, get over here! <laughs> Answer me! Who are you? Ah! Fine vessels. How astonishing for the first creatures I find to be humans of so high a caliber. So, who will join me? Two bodies! Take them! What's that? What did we just see? Uh, Lady Luz! Alain, you're here? You're both safe. I'm so glad. Oh, so glad. Are you really? Our mom? 
Rain and Lan. They lost all of their old memories when they were spliced out of Grimoire. They don't remember a thing. Lucky them. But that's good. Please, Howen. Promise me that you will forgive them. For me? I never... Subtlety. I can never abide it when a more direct solution is at hand. Come now. Did you not have some wish? Some grand desire you came here for me to grant? <laughs> Show me resolve. Show me ingenuity. Show me your power. Show me all the mirages at your behest. But do not show yourself to be lacking. What are... What kind of thing are you? I am Randalis, the mighty king of Bahamut, and number two five of the X-9 Knights. I am the conqueror of all a worlds, and their destroyer! No. You... You... are nothing but dust! You are going to pay for what you did! You fiend. I'm gonna make you wish that you were never born! Well, sis, you okay? Now, fall!
Shall we end this now? Sleep now forever. What strength. I can see A's power has already had a profound influence on both of you. Perhaps. I may not be able to destroy you, but neither can you put an end to me. To pursue this stalemate further would be a waste of time. That's what you think! I have to pay for bringing you into this world. This ends now! Lon? Hey, Rain. I know that I've put you through a lot of stuff. I'm selfish. And I'm sorry. It's all my fault that Mom and Dad died like that. And it's all my fault that these freaks have ruined Grimoire. Mine. I have to pay for it all. Watch me! to go home to my nine wood hills
You will not accept this. It was your doing, yours. And now you would refuse to accept the consequences? Accept it? How could you expect me to accept it? Lon takes the fall? While I cower in my fake world? I mean, this is my fault as much as it is his. He shouldn't have to pay my share. Who do I tell I'm sorry? Our mom and dad? Then I will ask you again. Will you? Or will you not accept the consequences? I will not! Not these! Very well. I shall yield to you all nine of my precious lives and give you a chance to continue your tale differently and weave the threads of time anew. Tick-tock. Tick-tock. Life sacrifice acknowledged. Now time shall be threaded anew. Bong. Bong.